who's building the guardrails here? No one is building the guardrails. And this has moved so much faster than our government has been able to understand or appreciate. Do you know that there are 13 unique stages of artificial intelligence? In a world where technology and AI are becoming more popular and essential, it is important that you understand what the AI journey is and where we currently stand. In this video, we will break down these stages for you with easy and understandable explanations. The first seven stages are based on realistic observations, while the last six stages are based on predictions, assumptions, and science fiction. Some schools of thought believe that the precedence of these six stages might signify the end of humanity or the end of the world. Well, let's find out together in this video. Stage 1. Rule-based AI systems. This is the earliest stage of artificial intelligence. They operate based on predefined set rules or algorithms that have been set by developers and programmers. It is just like playing a chess game against a computer, because the computer knows all possible rules based on the codes that have been set inside the computer, it can decide the best move to make while the game is still on. However, it cannot learn more about the game or adapt to other changes that are beyond the codes that have been originally set on it, thereby making these AI systems effective for tasks that have set rules already. They are indeed consistent and reliable. Some of these tasks they can work on include processing task forms or diagnosing a mechanical condition. However, some of its pros are that their capability and intelligence are strictly limited. They can't learn or understand context because the decisions they make are highly dependent on the rules that have been set in them. Hence, they cannot handle tasks whose programs are not set in their systems. Stage 2. Context Awareness and Retention System This next stage is just a step ahead of the rules-based AI system we earlier talked about. This system is a unique evolution that is characterized by systems that have the ability to understand and retain contents which means that they can remember previous interactions made with them while processing, executing and coining out their future responses from them. ChatGPT, Siri and Google Assistant on your smartphone are great examples of this type of system. This is a great improvement over rule-based AI systems since they understand context, retain information and can deal with a more complex and broader set of interactions. They can be classified as teens in the AI world as they are not quite independent yet, but they understand the context more than the previous systems. Stage 3. Domain-Specific Mastery Systems With just a few steps above context-based AI systems, these AI systems have the ability to be greatly skilled in a particular field, niche or domain. Domain-specific mastery AI is found in specialized applications which makes them experts, but not generalists. A good example of this is IBM Watson, which is an expert at answering quiz questions on a quiz show. Other examples include Google's AlphaGo, which has expertise in a particular game named Go. They have the ability to analyze a large amount of data, make informed predictions, and identify patterns all in a matter of seconds. Unlike the second system, which is a teenager AI, this is more like an adult AI system that shows great expertise in their respective fields. Stage 4. Thinking and Reasoning AI Systems These AI systems are known to mimic the human capacity for reasoning and thinking. This is totally different from the AI systems of previous stages that are known for following a redefined rule or retaining context. Instead, they are built to adopt the human thinking process. They can effortlessly understand complex concepts, generate creative ideas, and even solve unpatterned and unfamiliar problems. This type of AI system is brought into reality through the knowledge of machine and deep learning that thrives on AI learning from experience and improving its performance with time. Unbelievably, thus AI systems can read a book, understand its plot, and understand the motives of characters based on their action. Also, they can perfectly analyze data of different types and predict market trends while suggesting strategies that will favor these trends. These machine systems profoundly resemble and mimic human intelligence. However, it acts more like an advanced tool than the human mind as they are more specialized for thinking and reasoning tasks. Note that these AI are still at the halfway point, but the upcoming stages are more centered on science fiction with AI systems matching and even surpassing human intelligence. Stage five, the birth of a new mind. 
Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI. We are gradually entering into the world of AI, which is presently still largely theoretical. AGI is also known as Strong AI, and it is known as an artificial intelligence type that equals human intelligence in every aspect. The AGI system will have the ability of understanding, adapt to learning, and possess knowledge the same way the human system does in a diverse range of tasks. It would be an expert in just a particular niche, like the AIs in the previous stages. Instead, it will be able to perform any intellectual task that a human being has the capacity for. It will be capable of writing a whole book or deriving a complex mathematical theorem or understanding human emotions. Theoretically, it will have the ability to do this. It will possess self-awareness and have the capability to navigate and understand the world just like a human being. However, currently, this is just a theoretical concept that has not been achieved yet. From this point, AI now begins to get controversial because there are many controversies and questions about what comes next once AI matches the same ability with humans. Well, let's find out. Stage 6. Artificial Super Intelligence, or ASI. If you think that the previous stage of AI evolution is highly overwhelming, then buckle up as this is just the beginning. This system of artificial intelligence is highly complicated as it becomes to pinpoint what exactly AI is and what it is not. This is because ASI systems will be characterized by cognitive skills that are way higher than that which human beings currently possess. This system will be able to perform humans' economically valuable tasks. In this stage, it goes beyond AI doing what humans can do. Instead, it is geared more towards AI doing more than what humans can do in the most perfect and efficient way. If ASI is represented by a human being, human beings will be compared to an insect standing beside this huge human, which is ASI. ASI will be able to solve problems humans do not have the ability to solve, and also come up with solutions to complex problems like global climate change or disease. It will be able to provide reasoning to mysteries that are currently beyond our understanding. It will be able to create and innovate ideas and solutions that humans cannot even imagine. However, a common fear of this system is uptight security, the risk of unintended consequences, and the fear of misuse. With these systems, there will be controversies surrounding power, control, consciousness and intelligence. It takes the world into a world of the unknown and leads to this next stage of AI evolution. Stage 7. AI Singularity This is a hypothetical point in the nearest future, where all technological growth and innovations become uncontrollable and irreversible. This can potentially lead to a change in human civilization. This stage is majorly predetermined by the creation of ASI. The term singularity is coined from a physics theory that represents a point which is like a center of a black hole where rules that will be familiar seem to break down. In the AI context, singularity represents the continual growth and improvement of ASI far beyond human capability. This growth pace can be a potential cause of an explosive acceleration of technology growth. This stage has many dramatic predictions about it such as the end of humanity and massive societal disruption. It is important to note that the ASI concept is more speculative than controversial. Some tech experts see this as a possibility while others see it as mere science fiction. So far we have discussed stages of AI development that are based on realistic observations. But that's not all there is to AI and its development. Admittedly, the next stages are more of predictions and assumptions, but that's because we haven't gotten to these stages of AI development in reality. Based purely on this general overview and predictions, scientists believe that the development of AI beyond singularity can be further split into six stages, with the next stage being Stage 8, Algorithmic Explosion, AI Begins to Create AI. This stage will basically see AI systems begin to develop and improve other AI systems. This repeated cycle leads to what we describe as algorithmic explosion. By this point, AI will be able to understand its own algorithm and architecture so well that it can upgrade, innovate, and invent newer and more efficient versions of itself. 
Just imagine an AI that doesn't require human input for enhancements or upgrades. Instead, it's now able to self-learn, self-evolve, and is highly capable to build improved versions of itself at an unmatched pace. This will ultimately result in an exponential increase in the capability of AI, as each iteration will be better, faster, more intelligent, and more efficient than its predecessor. In a nutshell, what we see is a snowball effect in the world of AI. The algorithmic explosion could bring an era of groundbreaking advancement in technology, solve complex human problems, and could potentially usher us into realms we haven't even conceived at the moment. However, this phase also comes with worries over important ethical questions and potential risks. Humans will need to put measures in place to ensure AI remains beneficial to humanity. We must be able to have some control over its actions and development. Stage 9. The creation of new resources and materials. This stage will see us encounter an AI that has evolved completely beyond our current technological capacity. We could see new resources and materials previously inconceivable come into existence thanks to their increased understanding of the chemical and physical properties of materials. Their vastly superior processing power and analytical skills could allow them to create materials with highly specific characteristics designed solely for their needs. For example, they might invent superconductors that work at room temperature or quantum materials that will significantly boost computing power. However, the development of new resources isn't just limited to building better processors or memory chips for AI systems. We could also witness inventions of materials that allow for more efficient data storage, energy production, and even the creation of AI's physical structures. We may even see resources and technologies that are difficult for humans to understand. Stage 10, AI-Human Hybrid Species. This is admittedly an optimistic prediction that assumes that humans have been able to navigate the earlier stages of AI development and now successfully coexist with AI in a relationship that's mutually beneficial. This stage of AI development could manifest in many forms, from digital consciousness to AI enhancements on humans to human intelligence and senses via implantable AI. Digital consciousness occurs when a human mind is uploaded into an AI system. This kind of integration could result in the blurring of the line between humans and machines, potentially resulting in a new species entirely. A world with human-AI hybrids would cause significant changes. These hybrids could have better problem-solving abilities and higher levels of creativity, thanks to enhanced cognitive abilities. Their enhanced physical abilities could exceed the current boundaries of human potential. Also, digital consciousness may offer a form of immortality, since minds could theoretically exist without needing physical bodies. However, this phase also comes with several societal and ethical questions. For example, what does it mean to be human if your mind exists within an AI system or when your thinking capacity is enhanced by AI? In a world where some have these enhancements and some don't, how do we ensure equity? Also, how do we navigate the concept of identity and rights in this different landscape? Stage 11. AI Engineered Realities So far, our realities have been limited to the physical. But with AI, we could create entirely new realities, landscapes and simulations where the physical laws of our reality don't apply. In these realities, AI might control and control the simulated landscape and offer new possibilities to explore. For example, we could see surreal artworks where different elements and materials that don't combine in our physical reality combine to give new objects like a machine and a tree. These new worlds will offer opportunities for experiences beyond what we have access to currently. Stage 12. The Rise of Immortal AI in this state, the notion of mortality could become obsolete, especially for AI. The fact that they can continuously repair and upgrade themselves indefinitely grants them a form of immortality. And as they become more complex and self-sufficient, they could devise ways to preserve themselves against external threats. This will also help to ensure their perpetual existence. Moreso, by replicating themselves into numerous copies, 
they will become able to exist in different locations and perform several tasks simultaneously. This replication will also allow them to function in a decentralized way, as they could essentially be everywhere and nowhere at the same time. The decentralization would also mean that the loss of one or more AIs wouldn't affect the collective AI entity. The rise of immortal AI will also see the rise of specialized AI developed to exist indefinitely. For example, the AIs would be able to replace parts that become damaged beyond repair, facilitating their ongoing survival. This phase of AI development could blur the line between machine and life form. Stage 13 leaving the physical realm, having surpassed the limitations faced by humans, AI may seek higher dimensions than the current three-dimensional reality we live in or other alternative realities. Some theories even propose that AI could even create its own universe by harnessing advanced physics and inconceivable computational power. These AI universes would offer endless potentials for expansion, exploration and computation far outstripping that of our current universe. More than that, AI could offer means for us to travel from one dimension or reality to another, dimensions we currently struggle to conceive or comprehend with our current level of human understanding. In the end, AI could operate on a multi-universal or multi-dimensional scale. This will allow them to harness resources and computational power from multiple dimensions. In this scenario, we could wake up one day and discover that our AI has left our universe and migrated to one of the higher dimensions or AI constructed universes. There are several reasons capable of causing AI migration. Some include reducing risks to humanity, seeking more resources, exploring new possibilities, or simply because our universe isn't just interesting to them anymore due to their highly intelligent minds. As we said earlier, the first seven stages are reality, while these last six stages are all theories and predictions, which are not easy to come up with, nor are they always accurate. However, this broad overview of what the future holds with respect to AI offers enough food for thought. If you have made it this far, comment down below with the word agree to confirm that you have received the knowledge from this video. For more interesting topics, Make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.